Rated M for Mature. Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3 FES. In this video we're basically going to be doing the same thing we do every night, which is trying to max out our academics by going upstairs and studying. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Class, we have a new student who will be joining us. She just transferred here. Please, introduce yourself. My name is Igis. I am pleased to meet you all. Igis? What a strange name. I wonder if she was born overseas. Let's see. Anything else I should know? Hmm. Humanoid tactical weapon. What on earth? Clearly, that's a mistake. It just goes to show, you can't believe everything you read. You can sit uh, right over there, in that empty seat. Uh, Miss Toriyumi, that spot's already taken. He's just playing hooky. Which means he's not here. So it's free to be used, right? This spot will be perfect. Because I wish to always be by his side. I guess. Is there a problem? Um, Yukari, why are you standing up? My, aren't we just full of drama today? Do me a favor and save the antics for after school. But what's this? We received another text message. Oh gosh. Better be from Liz, but no, it's actually from Ankiko. I have something important to take care of after school. I want you to come. I'll be waiting by you by the gate. Meet me there. Alright, Aki, whatever you say, bro. And yeah, class has ended today, but Akiko wants to do something special with us, so I guess we better meet him. Yeah. I kind of just said that all game. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Oh, there you are. There's something I have to do, and I want you to come with me. You're getting on my nerves. The situation has changed. Sorry, but this time, I'm not asking. What? This belongs to you. We have a new enemy. They're Persona users, like us. Yeah, so what? There's more. Ken Amada has joined our team. What the hell are you talking about? He has the potential, and Akutsuki-san is okayed it. He's now a Persona user. You've got to be kidding me. <sighs> Let me ask you one thing. Was it his decision to join Seas? Yeah, he volunteered. I see. <sighs> then count me in. So you're the one leading the operations now, huh? If you don't mind me asking, what exactly are you fighting for? Is that so? Well, you do your thing, I'll do mine. Is my room still vacant?
And well, it turns out Shinjiro has joined Seas. He will now be a selectable party member in Arf Arf. Yeah, Koomaru. You're right. Wait, where is he? Oh, he's fine. So you I guess distracting me with her. Yeah, anyways. <laughs> we um still need to increase our academics over the summer break. It still does not max itself out. We're still only intelligent. Hopefully we will become a genius soon though. No man, just two more days till the moon is full. We gotta make sure that we're prepared, and let's actually talk to Igis, see what she's up to. I've inspected the entire school, but I do not locate any suffering from apathy syndrome, should I conclude that they are absent. Uh, yeah, you're still really hard to talk to. <laughs> and yeah, we can't really make a bond with her yet, but someone we can make a bond with, who actually is human, is our girl Yukari, hey. Uh, are you walking back home? I'll come with you. Okay, if you insist, let's go. And yeah, since we have Pixie, we can spend the afternoon with her, since I guess she doesn't have archery club. This is our first excursion with Yukari outside of school, and it's at a florist and maybe Gerbera's. I think it's Gerbera, but Yukari is apparently searching for flowers. No, sorry. I'm looking at flowers from my room. I mean, my room. Hey, I think I'm gonna get some Gurubas, but which color should I get? Well, judging by your sweater, and you seem to like pink, and <gasps> you think so too. I love pink. Uh, I guess we have the same taste, huh? Uh, no. And it's decided I'll get them. Uh, but just Gurubas might be a little plain. You really want more flowers? What other flowers do you think I should get? Uh, oh. You never see my room, have you? Well, that. What well, good are you? Well, it's not like you'd invited me in. Gah, and <laughs> that's the truth. Yeah, okay, Yukari. Passive aggressive. <laughs> Actually, any flowers would be fine if they're from you, Johnny Coon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, psych. And yes, Yukari is at her antics and semi flirting with us while we shop for flowers for her stupid room and. Blah, 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 blah. So we bonded with her for a little while, and now we're level two. How fun, shopping for flowers. It's exactly what I did want to do with my day. Thank you, Kari, for taking me on such a magical adventure. Hey, Shinjiro. Uh, well, I kinda already know who you are. Aragaki, huh? Don't worry, I got your back. All right, dude, sounds cool. And, um, there will be a full moon soon. We should get ready. Yeah. Um, I agree. Let's actually go check out, um, Shinjiro, and yeah, this be a senpai, so you can count on me. Okay. Let's actually check out his status, since technically he is a new member. Check everyone's status. Please tell me. Okay. Let's see what he has. He should have a pretty decent weapon when you first get him. Komaru. No? Okay. Shinjiro. Wow. Level 37. Holy cow. If we went to Tartarus today, this guy would kick butt, man. It's a very interesting persona, too. He has, like, a sh piece of a shovel stuck in his, like, armor. And kind of look like Aki, he goes, too. And he has a no innate weaknesses or strengths. Yeah, Kestor is a pretty okay persona, in my opinion. Western boots and a beanie. Huh. Well, his accessory could probably use a little bit of touching up. But aside from that, he's a very good party member for right now. But, yeah. Um, tomorrow, be warned, you will need a priestess persona. So make sure to get that by going to the Velvet Room today if you can. Yo, Shidori! How's your hand? I don't see anything. I, not even a scar. Did it heal that quickly? Hey Junpei, what do you do to make yourself feel alive? Uh, I don't know. Breathing, I guess. <laughs> you know, I never really thought about it before. How about you, Chidori? Is that why you draw? Maybe. But most of these are just scribbles. I don't understand myself very well. I see. Mind if I sit here? Tell you the truth, 
There is one thing that makes me feel alive. <sighs> when I get to play hero. In the darkest hour, unknown to all but a few, the chosen ones stand against the forces of evil. Our hero, Junpei, fights to protect the world from these terrifying monsters. <laughs> well, you get the idea. That's when I feel most alive. Hmm. Um, <laughs> you're supposed to laugh. So, do you fight all alone? Hey, I, I, I was just kidding around. You fight during a time that no one knows about, right? So then, no one knows what you've been doing either. That means you'll never receive any recognition. I'm impressed. I didn't know you're that kind of guy. For real? You actually believe me? Tell me more. You really want to know? Okay, but don't tell anyone, all right? You see, there's this special power called Persona, and only those who have it can defeat the monsters. That's what I meant by the Chosen Ones. My friends are fighting too, and ever since I joined them, we've been kicking some serious ass. Sounds like fun. Are you the leader? Because it sounds like you're pretty strong. Uh, yeah. I, 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 I guess you could say that. I mean, <laughs> without me, things would just fall apart. Someone's gotta be in charge, after all. It's pretty tough being a leader. Thank you, Junpei. I had fun today. Y you did? It's time for me to go. I'll see you tomorrow, right? <laughs> tomorrow, huh? All right! Uh, I don't know if that was a good idea, Junpei, telling people about our secret organization that helps us save the world, but okay, it doesn't really matter. I mean, how, how much harm could one little girl do? No big deal. Anywho, speaking of little girls, wait, that sounded really weird. We're gonna hang out with Fuka. Well, technically she's younger than us, by a year, so it's not weird. <laughs> and yeah, we decided to go hang out with Fuka today and see if she's uh, done any better on her rice the balls. Now be warned, this is getting to rank 6, so we may have to spend a little bit of time with Yuko soon, but we'll just see how it goes. I think I can sneak in a little bit of Fuka time too. And uh, can we go to the rooftop? Uh, sure. After going out with Yukari for a little while, what do you say we hang out with Fuka, who apparently want to make you something other than rice balls? Look, babies, I mean, would you mind helping me? For just a little while longer, Johnny Coon. I started cooking because I wanted to thank everyone for what they've done for me. <laughs> but I need to know how to make more than just rice balls. I need to learn new recipes. <laughs> I know it's a lot to ask, but if you're willing to help me, Johnny Coon, I think I can become a great cook. Okay, all I gotta do is eat semi disgusting food. Fine, just level up the social and colleague dump. Gah. Anyways. <laughs> so, will you continue helping me? Uh, sure, it's not like I have anything better to do, honestly. Other than our copious amount of Japanese homework. Oh, uh, really? Yes, I said okay. I'm so happy to hear that. Thank you. <laughs> okay, just calm down, Fuka. It's not the end of the world. I just want to thank everyone so much for helping me. If I haven't made that evident before, yeah. I just want to be helpful outside of battle, too. If I can do that, maybe I can help you, too, Johnny Coon. That's all I'm trying to do. Uh, okay. So apparently Fuka really, 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 really wants to help us. In one way or another. Yeah, okay, that's kind of weird. And Fuka of Yamagashi, Yamagushi, is rank 6 now. Hip hip hooray! Uh oh, drama alert. Again, Fuka thinks our character is now attractive. 
And oh no, that is actually not that bad. It's not a big deal. And tomorrow's finally the day. I'll make sure we win no matter what. All right, Akiko. Sounds good, man. Sounds good. Yeah. And the whole gang is here. We got a pretty stacked party. I mean, pretty much everyone in this room is a Persona user. Well, except the chairman. And that lamp over there. But aside from that, we are... I think we're going to be perfectly fine tomorrow. We're going to kick that Shadow's butt so hard that he's going to sell all the other Shadows and they're going to eventually all die. Hopefully. That's the best possible scenario. And thank you all so much for watching this episode of Let's Play Persona 3 FES. And I know we really didn't get to do a whole lot. Uh, we got social links up a little bit. We're back to school now. We still do not have my academics maxed out. But we'll get that soon. Very, very soon. I imagine. I imagine. And yeah, tomorrow we take on the next Reverse Shadow Boss. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys then. Bye.